How was the Evo test salty? All right, let's just let's just get into it then. So it was an Evo test. It, it's I don't know. It's kind of hard to explain to you guys that um, that it's not. Sometimes they just do things for their own end, and uh, I'll just tell you I logged in. I went to Pyro. One of the big things was, uh, I guess what we should do is take a quick peek at at the the patch notes, which were more of a, it was just a testing focus. So just to give you a, a bit of a rundown, let me bring those up for us. Uh, okay. That was, oh, focus testing, not feedback. Sorry, wrong forum. Okay. So let's take a peek at this first and foremost. Um, this was the Evocati play test focus test. This is actually on the focus testing forum. Any of you guys that are backers can go and see it. It was very, very simple. Um, you chose Pyro from the menu or you chose uh, Stanton from the menu. This was something that was leaked like many, 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 like like two years ago. That would be a possibility as a choice for you to like, we would get Pyro without meshing. Right, um, that never happened because this is technically meshing, I, not entirely. Right, um, so it's my understanding that it was like it's the replication layer turned on. Right, so this is a f and uh, it says it here in this first in a long series of meshing playtests. Today's build will consist of shards with two servers statically meshed with one running in Stanton and the other running in Pyro. You will be able to choose which location to go to, and we all would love to see Pyro again, uh, but again, we would like a healthy mix of both star systems populated to get the data needed for Ivan, Claw, uh, Clive, and Paul. And the whole server meshing team to continue to iterate and improve meshing. The big thing here is they said do not use the jump gates or you're going to get kicked out, essentially. Um, because th that would cause like a major issue for everybody. Um, I went pyro. So what I will say is I read the known issues. Pyro based missions are not currently being offered. So I was like, okay. I thought they meant like the pyro exclusive missions. No, 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 no. Um, I, I just like grabbed the first salvage mission that I saw without looking. It was in Hurston L4. <laughs> I can't get to Hurston L4 from Pyro, right? So there's there were some funny things there uh, with that. So that's what they meant by that. Uh, there were actually no missions available. I did quantum travel to... I started to. Um, the Pyro 6. Way, way out. Did I see a marker? No marker. Um... I went to I started going to Pyro 6 but then I heard that it's like not really there and then I started jumping to Pyro 5 I ran out of fuel and by then it was kind of late and I was like I'm in Pyro there's nothing to do I'm bored and I logged off okay so that was the like honestly that was the test for me it was very 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 minor um and they were just gathering data from behind the scenes I will say that Pyro never crashed for me but I did hear that Stanton crashed and recovered within three minutes this time. Still unacceptable for a live game, I think, but getting better. Certainly better than two hours, which was the last test, right? Um, so, I mean, that's almost a 50% improvement from the first test. So we got to call those out as very, very good things. Progress equals good. Um, and that's it. So I really don't have much. Uh, I don't know what you guys think uh, and, and what, like, maybe Durval in chat. You got a bounty hunting mission for Pyro 3 and Stanton. Well, that's, you know, that might sound funny, but if 
maybe they're communicating to each other. I don't in some way. There, and what I will say about this is the pyro play test for that everybody was losing their minds over. The pyro play test that everyone was losing their minds over was clearly thrown together for Citizen Con because. No, like nothing in pyro was working so you know they're they're setting the expectations here on uh let me bring it back up with what when they said i don't know where my mouse is here it is uh the first in a long series of play tests pyro is nowhere near ready uh to go i will say that pyro is nowhere near ready to go it is it's it's a bit of a ways off, right? But what we don't know is what's going on in like game dev. Maybe they took like a really old pyro version, whatever. Um, but if I don't know what everybody's expectations of pyro is, I know what mine are. Um, the first implementation of anything is not going to be good, right? So that's basically what. Uh, I'm trying to say is it's not really going to be uh, filled with content, I don't think. Um, yeah, like you will be able to go to the locations. Very similar to the playtest, I feel like, is what we might end up with based on that. But again, a short test might not even be what they're working on. Who knows? But that was something to call out. It was like not a lot was working. A lot's falling apart. Are they even caring about it right now at this time? Hard to say, right? I think the focus is very much 323, and 323 is very much uh, Stanton-focused, I would say, right? Or just general gameplay-focused and not pyro-location-focused. So, you know, if you had a bunch of people all focused on one star system, like pyro, in, you know, six months, eight months, nine months, whenever uh, it's approximately supposed to be here, based on, I think, Jared's words, then... Maybe they can get some stuff, cool stuff done, but hard to say. Also, like, yeah, all the missions broken, not a surprise, and all that stuff. Uh, there was... You summarized Dade's comments, what, from my Discord? Eva saw very few crashes. Apparently, Salty Mike, who's Evil Cotty, got 30k and the server was back up in two minutes. No, I wasn't. I never got a 30k. Where does this even come from? I never even said anything. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. I'm bringing this up. People are so stupid, dude. Okay. The apparently section of this OP is miscommunicated and taken from Salty Mike's Discord. This is what was actually discussed. The shard ID was 10. The Stanton server that crashed. So so I guess one server can crash and not an, another, which is not a surprise, but also a thing worth calling out, right? The Pyro 10 playtest gameplay was unaffected while Stanton 10 recovered. Recovery took around two and a half minutes. Further info. Stanton had the player test activity load uh, as very little was functional on the pyro side. Yeah, that was what I, I was noticing. Like, of course pyro didn't crash. All we really can do is quantum travel around. I think some people were mining. Maybe you could have found salvage at a Lagrange point, but I'm not really sure. Ayando said that he had a recovery of 30 seconds. Now, for me, that would be entirely reasonable um, because the expectation would be in the long term, uh, like, you know, re released game five years from now, that servers don't crash, really, right? Sometimes, but very rarely, you know, it's not like every two hours like we have now. Inventory response was fine. Um, there were not that many active people, so I think that's the next thing to call out, is there were like 47 active on Pyro while Stanton recovered, right? Global chat was not shared, which I think is a good thing. And there was a bedlock bug to get from Pyro to Stanton. I didn't know about this. And this was Durval, uh, who got the Stanton, uh, the Pyro um, bounty hunter mission while in Stanton. So, 
Yeah, I think if we if we got down to actually thirty seconds to recover uh, a server during like alpha beta, that's huge. But that was the play test. I mean, listen, a lot of people are really excited to hear about Evo. Evo's not that exciting or interesting a lot of the times, especially when they don't include anything about um like features coming like 323 evo is going to be significantly more interesting to discuss with you guys than this it is just very exciting that they're they had two servers together communicating to a replication layer we don't exactly know how it went on their end unless they communicated in testing chat and i didn't see that but not a lot of crashes Seemingly everyone on Stanton was having a reasonable time. And um, yeah, so there's not much to discuss or much to see, but it wasn't a complete disaster. So thumbs up <laughs> and we'll just leave it at that, right?